this was train crashes. You know it's like tr crash crash. You might want to check this video out if you're a fan of trains, uh, but you're not a fan of train crashes, and you want to know how to play Trains and World if you if you busy watching this while it's downloading. This is the thing for you. Well, I have been playing this, but if you're playing for the first time, you might want to actually, you might want to see how the game works. So, 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 might end up in, but it's not corridor. You don't want to go there. You want to go to Great Western Express. You want to click the X button on it into it and you don't want to go into into scenarios and time demo <coughs> until you've done the training so if you're a beginner you want to want to click x on trains and world introduction that is the, that will tell you okay so necessarily it won't the game won't tell you because You've got me here. Yo, I've got me here. To teach you. I know how to... I know how to drive basically every single train in the game. Yeah, I've been playing this Let's one. take a look at the main controls of exploring and driving trains. Yeah. So... You've just been awarded some action points. These are displayed in the top right corner of the screen and count towards your overall experience. Yes. It is necessary to be fully observant of the surrounding world. Practice by looking up, down, left and right. So... So, let me tell you... Besides operating trains, there are lots of requirements to navigate on foot. Try moving around now. A blue marker indicates that an objective requires action. Walk over to the highlighted marker to complete this objective. This is one of many interactives to be discovered, but not all of them will be as easy to find as this one. So yeah. Head over to the indicated train doors to learn more about interaction. So, let me first tell you about how you get action points. So, you get action points for, for going below the speed limit, going above the speed limit, going significantly below the speed limit, doing, like, placing one of these, uh... I can think of. Some doors need to be. Climb aboard the train. Okay, so. Quickly want to find. Button. Head over and sit in the indicated seat. Yeah, it's just a boring first. You can pause seat. the game at any point and review the previous and current tasks. There's also a map, but it takes. It's now time to head up to, to the front. It takes for every Open the door. Okay. A lot of time will be spent operating trains, so when ready... So... A heads-up display has appeared on the right side of the screen. This is a guide to what the train is doing. So... This is a speed display. The white needle shows current speed, and the red marker indicates the maximum permitted speed. This is a direction display. An arrow will indicate forwards, reverse, and neutral directions. This is the power display. A number will indicate what position the power control is in. Yes, I got all of that. These are brake pressure dials. They will indicate how much pressure is in various brake systems and show when the pressure hey, is changing. Hey, this train uses Mr. to run! Okay. Uh... In the top right are the signal and speed limit displays. These feature an indication of what is approaching and a countdown distance to when they will come into effect. Yes, so... Some of these displays can be hidden via the settings menu for a more challenging experience. Yeah. So... 
Now we go right. This train is ready to go. Pull the indicated handle all the way back to get moving. So all the way back, you don't always want to do these. But he's telling me to put the power to full power. Yeah, baby, let's go. Right on the station. Are you playing the game? Just make sure, sure. Continue your journey in Train Sim World. Take part in training designed to teach you how to operate on the railway. Engage in scenarios that will present challenges and enhance your skills. Dive into a full timetable on the railway. Whether you're driving, riding or watching trains, you have the freedom of the line. Each route has a set of jobs such as posters to place or fences to fix. Find them all and complete the job list for each route. Welcome to Train Sim World. Yeah, I'm also British. I was born in the UK, but I do live in South Africa. So, I feel like, hey, shouldn't I complete it? Like, okay, okay. You can't just go in. You can't just go. You can just go into timetable or any other mode, such as scenarios, scenarios, train, training, or journeys. You can just hop into them by simple press of the X button or what button you use to interact. You can. But that was the introduction, that, and that was my version. Okay, that wraps it up for the video.